Hi, I'm Laughing Woman, and I'm doing a reading so that we can see what the week holds for us and how we can work with it really well. The first card is Achiever of Water, Idealism. The second card is Major 16, Awakening. The third card is Three of Fire, Growth. The fourth card is Major 9, Solitude. And the fifth card is Eight of Bridges, Adjust. So what I'm seeing here is that we're beginning the week in our ideal visions of something or another. And as the week starts and gets moving a little bit, we come to terms with what really is possible. That's what this awakening is. It takes us from our vision into what we're actually willing and able to manifest. That's the awakening that's occurring. And this is a big awakening, so know that the way that you're seeing this this week may very well tie into other dynamics in your life. In the middle of the week, we're in growth. And what that tells me is that we're in the process of actually incorporating that awakening into our being so that we don't have to be wakened up to it again, so that it truly is ours. From growth, we move to solitude. And solitude here just says, I'm taking what I've been learning, I'm taking it into my private space, and I'm incorporating it into my being without the input of other people at this point. At the end of the week, we make little adjustments to what we've learned through the course of the week. We, we tailor that learning to us and our own lives. So big thing I want you to know is that this is a week that's about learning. And a lot of the learning is how your ideals actually apply to the physical plane. This is wonderful information to get about yourself because it helps in all sorts of manifestation, whatever you're trying to bring in. So in summary, there's a little emotion here at the beginning with our idealism. Feel it, love it, be with it and be ready to wake up to what aspects of that are actually possible to manifest. Grow into embracing that instead of seeing that as potential limitations or, oh my gosh, it could get bigger than I want it to be. Just grow into it and take some time toward the end of the week to be by yourself, enjoy your own wisdom, and tailor what you're learning to fit who you really are. Have yourself a wonderful week. Mm.